Hey guys, a quick video to show you how to deal with a common problem of a bit getting stuck in your impact driver. Uh, normally, you take a driver, you pull this out, you just pull your bit out. But sometimes they get jammed in there from the over torque and pressure, whatever it is. And no matter what you do, you can't pull it out by hand. Um, two people, probably easy to remove. One person holds this out, another one grabs a pair of pliers and pulls on it so you rip it out. Put in a vise, maybe if you have a vise. But if you don't, I want to show you guys a quick trick how to do it with some zip ties, 12 gauge, that's what I have on hand, electrical wire, and a pair of pliers. Um, this can happen to any impact driver, Milwaukee, Ryobi, Rigid, you know, Makita. The idea is the same. They all pop out and the bit comes out. Uh, this so this can usually happen with cheap bits like some aftermarket junk You know that's just soft and metal and will jam in there So the trick is you want to be able to hold and hold this out the entire time So you can try to pull it out. Uh, you can grab a wire And as you pull this back you just wrap the wire around Till it stays out once the wire is holding it the bit will just come out and that will work with any of these drills. It's all the same idea. You just gotta get into that space there uh, and hold it out as much as possible. So let's say this one, this one did get stuck for me. Uh, it was a similar bit to this one, che cheaper version. You know, so this is the one I'm gonna show you guys on. But this actually happened to me just a couple of days ago. So I wanna show you how I resolved it. Instead of wire, I used a zip tie. So I took a zip tie. Pull this back, tighten the zip tie till it gets in there. So now the zip tie is holding this entire thing to the front. So now this part technically is loose, the bit should come out. But if the bit doesn't want to come out, you can grab a plier, any kind, hold it against the ground and pull it, right? So I grabbed one of the self-locking pliers, put it on the ground. Put my foot on it, and with two hands, pull as hard as possible and rip the bit out. Then you just cut off the zip tight, and you're good. Get a good, reliable bit, and you're back in business. I hope this is helpful. Thank you for watching. Any questions or comments, please do. Thank you.